G'day and welcome back to Land of the Vikings here on Dark Solar Gaming and we are continuing on with this new early access city builder with a Viking theme. Alright, so we're in episode, what are we in now? Episode 3. So we've started building our little village, we've built our fishing dock, we've built our shipyard and things are starting to progress. Um, we do need some more stone. I've just noticed we're out of stone, which means that we're not going to make any more dressed stone, which we need for some of our buildings. Um, we've also got our mine over here. It's not complete as well. But anyway, yeah, still got timber being cut down. Um, I'm going to put these trees over here into the uh, thing first. Now, I don't know there's been a patch for this since we last recorded. Um, don't think there has, but uh, that's, that's fine. I mean, the the game doesn't have a problem I'm saying that, but I uh, don't think there's been any updates since. All right, so we've got all those trees being done. We're going to take it off pause now and just continue. Uh, we have got another fishing boat being constructed down here, so the ship is under construction, as you can see, and busy pouring away on the timber. And we'll start to see a framework of the hull of the fishing boat uh, will be constructed in here. And then we'll have two fishing boats. But the other problem we've got is we have a look at our population. Um, we've only got two labourers at the moment. So we need to be careful once we get another ship, uh, another one in here. Although I can, what I can do is I can slow that down. I can put one in there and get a labourer back. Uh, carpenter, probably put that back to one. Um, builder, oh, actually I'll put the carpenter to two. The builder to one. Gatherer. Ultra, don't care. Hunter, fisherman, you've got two fishermen, that's okay. Yeah, that'll be okay. But I need, just need to make sure I've got labourers. Um, now, I did also notice that um, I had two people at least that were homeless still. I don't know how I missed them. But we've built two more houses going in here, so we've got them going in. Um, I'm going to put a path in here as well. Down. Okay. Right, and then that way they can take the path. Um, that's all tickety boo. Right. Don't destroy that. Thanks for building. All right. So now we're hurry up and wait. Now, this, we were full up here a minute ago, but obviously we're not now. Okay, 176 out of 180 stored in there. Uh, down here we've got 60 out of 55. Our herbalist hut, got three herbs. Our stone cutter, well we need stone. Oh, we've got stone coming in now, so that's good. Uh, our warehouse is 109 out of 165 and zero out of 165, so that's okay. All right. Uh, our family over here, Ira Iri Getson and Aslog Villa. Oh, I'm not even gonna bother. Uh, and their newborn baby. We want them to have children. Oh, they look like they're fully grown children. I wouldn't say they're children. Um, no wife. Okay. All right. Carpenter. Okay. Uh, we've got three three older children and one younger child. They can get to see all your family and all your community, how they're growing and all that sort of stuff. So that, I do like this part. It's actually quite good. I have got no food in the house, but anyway. All right. Okay. The food, we've got 250 food, so total number of meals is okay for the moment. Um, let's see, where are we at now? So we're in spring still, so we're going to come to, um, what, summer next? Um, and then we've got autumn or fall, and then we've got winter again. So we've just come out of winter, so um, it's okay. All right, we might just fast forward a bit, because we're going to go into night time again now. Just fast forward through night. Really fast through night. And so you can see with a little torch. The great game this it's got some great detail in it. So when you when you do zoom in, and as we saw before with the building of the boat and everything, detail in it is fantastic for an early access game. Really, really good. Fishing boats come in. Going off to have a sleep. Coming in today again now, so we can slow it down a bit. 
sunrise. See the shadows as well? It's just it's just glorious, it really is. Towards where the sun's coming up. Glorious. Lovely looking game. Lovely looking game. Anyway. Alright, let's get back into it. Duck, what are we doing? Right, uh, four labourers. Produce there, produce there. Just needs another 15, another 10 stone now. And you need 25 stone. What have we got in the way of stone? We've got some stone there, that's fine. We better bring it in and get that going. What we need though is we need more people. So we either need some more visitors to come and, and help us out and join our, uh, our clan, or we need a lot more kids to be born. Oh, hang on, what have we got here? Someone's sad. Who's sad? Say it's what's your name? Dooglabatha. You. You? Yeah, it's you. Why are you unhappy? Well, you've had a little bit of sleep. You've had some food now. Maybe you're not so unhappy anymore. Four clothes. Oh, well, that's what we need. We do need clothes. Um, so if we look at the tree of life, the next expansion we're going to get, um, when we get another five, another three, um, what's names? Uh, is the tailor. We're getting the tailor to build some clothing and also the blacksmith for tooling. So um, we do need to get those, but that's okay. All right. Things are still moving nicely. I'm going to fast forward my speed. There's nothing much is really happening at the moment, so we're not missing out. Bring all the goods over. We've built up some more dressed stone. We've got some stone. Our silver's increased. We've got some wood and we've got some timber. Excellent. And we're still in year one, day four. That can't be right. Year one, day four. I don't think that's quite right. Considering we've already been through winter. We've already been through spring. We've been through a couple more days than just four. Anyway, this is day four of spring. We'll find out when it goes to um, we transition as to whether or not um, this how this changes. Are we going to see how that changes actually? Right, oh, hang on now. This house is now in six timber, twenty stone. For the next part. It's good too, it's in stages. So like the first stage here, cook. So if we go back to this one here, um takes three three wood or three um yeah, three wood and twenty-five stone. You get the um foundations built, that's that's what you need. And then to build the rest of the house you need six timber and um twenty stone. So that's it's good, it's it makes it um you're not just dropping all the goods off and just making it. It's actually a, a bit of a staged approach to building. I think that's quite good. There we go. Now we're bringing in more, more items to continue building that house. All right. Really do like this. This is a, a wonderful looking game. Just looks wise. So they sort of oh because they don't hunt the night twice so now they're gonna come back go back to hunting Kitty boo all right now we're going back over here still going with the house building boat building still going slowly it seems we've Oh, we got another labourer. Wait, how'd that happen? We get a child grow up. Um, oh, there we go. Thor became an adult. Oh, and Vilad's Asgrimson died. Okay. We've got two, two more births. Okay, that's that's handy to know. I'm get rid of that one. I'll put this one up. I'm going to lock both of them in place. Whoops. 
Oh, oh yeah. Oh, anyway, all right. There we go. Um, this messages thing gives us the. Um... Well, hang on. The same person died twice. <laughs> and Thora became an adult like three times. Really? There's got to be something wrong there. All right. I think there's something not quite right with our messages tab. Anyway, we'll leave it up there now and we should see the messages that come through. Yeah, okay. Right. All right, so what are we in now? We are now in spring. Hang on. Daytime. Spring. This, shouldn't this be summer? I, I don't think that's quite right. Year one, day five. I think I think we should be coming into summer, not spring. I mean, that, let, hang on. Let me let me see if we got this right. We got summer, autumn, fall, winter, spring, summer. All right. So um, that's spring. It should be summer. Uh, it says spring. Okay. Anyway, all right. Okay. All right. Any details from that, that's fine. All right, how are we going here? Uh, halfway through to getting our, we've got our timber now, so all we need now is our stone to finish that one off. And this one here, we're still waiting on stone as well. All right, with six laborers now, um, we can probably look at increasing things again. So let's put two builders on, and I'm going to put uh, two ship builders on. We've got four laborers. Means we're going to build the ships quicker and build the buildings uh, as well. Right, I'm going to go over here and see how our mine's going. So I don't think they're actually doing anything over here. I don't know if I paused. Right, right let me have a look. Okay, I didn't pause it. So it is, it is still building. 32 or 32. I oh, just need a lot of stone. That's what it is. A lot of stone. That's all right. That'll that'll happen slowly. I'm not gonna not gonna cry over that one. It'll just happen in due course. All right. 181 meals. So meals are okay still. We don't need to worry about going out and putting any more hunters or gatherers out. Um, we're we're sustaining enough at the moment. We'll have another fishing boat soon, hopefully as well. Um, what happened to that? I thought we we're already building a. Build a ship. Okay, we got, oh, we finished it. Maybe we finished it. Good two. Here we go, another fishing boat. All right. Then we've got three, two fishing boats. So fishermen, we need to increase to three. That means labourers are down to two. Okay. So that means we need to um, drop our shipbuilders back to one. Carpenters will be fine. Yeah, that'll be okay for now. All right. Um, we need to assign a worker. Uh, advantageous talents, intelligence, and speed. Okay, intelligence, uh, speed. We're going to be the better candidate. There we go. All right. Okay, our um, market over here. Is full again 187, 180. Fruit, got meat, we got in here. Oh, yeah, we got two working there, two working on us. Okay, right there we go. Now it says summer, right? So now we're in the middle of summer. Good, coming into summer. E1 day six, really. Let me have a look at this. Uh, settings, uh, gameplay, user interface scale, our data collection. Uh, auto assign, workers button. Okay, let's have a look at that. Uh, graphics, that's where about graphics. Okay. Um, I don't know we've got our auto assign button yet, but um, 
Oh, good. Okay. But. What I was on? Oh, okay. What I was on button there. Uh, two laborers, two builders. Yeah, okay, that's okay. We'll keep the thing now. Right, 85. Oh, look, did that house get finished? Here, got finished. So that's, uh, so we've got a poor house. That's fine. That means, hopefully, we have no one. If there's two people moved in, we should have no one that's homeless. And that was the goal. Make sure we had no one homeless. Right. Excellent. Now. Uh, what else we got going on? So I guess we can start putting some more decorations down. Um, let's have a look at the buildings. Food. Cattle ranch and goat ranch and a coop. I put a coop in. I thought I put a chicken coop in. Maybe I didn't. Goat ranch, coop. But I need more people. I can't, there's no point putting that. Production. Um, fine. Windmill. Bread is made from wick. Haven't got any fields. So, stone pit. A stone pit. Be somewhere. Yeah, the garden path. Oh, okay, so they go on there. Okay. Fine. Alright, well, I don't want one of them yet. Put one up there. Uh, okay, same pit. There. Oh, that's where they. Um, so production brewery. Here's Bruce Park. Don't have any um. Any fuel. Enough silver or gold. This area we're costing ground. Right, so I need to put some of that in. I also want to put some more um decorations in. Uh, I haven't got any more decorations. I haven't got any more tree of life. So I guess we're just going to have to continue with what we're doing and seeing how things happen. Uh, our other boat is almost ready. We should have two boats now. There goes the second boat. So we've got two boats out there fishing. That means our amount of fish coming in should be uh, improved. I'm not going to put the other boat active yet until I've got more people. Um, I'll leave that uh, base out the sleeve. All right. Cool. Uh, what else we got? Deputies. Uh, order wheat production, assign a farmer, build a wheat farm. Oh, okay. Reach 40 villages. Well, I need to obviously do... Or transition to settled life in the tree of... Um, transition to settled life. Crops in the field grow five percent faster. Crops durability will increase. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna activate both of those. So explore that one. I'm gonna explore that one. Oh, what have I got over here now? Got game. Grain warehouses provide ten percent more space, and villages work five percent faster in the field. So uh, that's good. Yep. Okay. That one there comes off. Obviously, villages work five percent faster. That's obviously how villages work faster as well. All right, now I know I've used those, so now I need another, oh damn, what is it, another five or six? There. But, uh, full transition to settled. Oh, okay, I didn't need to do that actually. I need to build a field, build a well, build a wheat production, build a wheat grainy, build windmill and sign a miller, produce your first bread. Right. Well, we'll do all that soon. Field, there we go. I can do a field now. Let's do it. Um, so my first field, I'm going to put in. There. And, oh, it needs 31 silver. I don't know. This is wrong. Okay. My idea would be to do a nice square field. I'll we'll have to see how that goes. Right, what we got over here? Sign. That can be problematic. I've only got two labourers. If I just thought I was signed people, I shouldn't. 
Let's see. Seemingly not. Let's see about uh, the population note. I want this. Right, Erie gets and died due to a work incident. Uh, became an adult, is now a child. Became an adult, is now a child. Okay, cool. Cool, that's why we've got a couple of extra people available. We had one, two, three, four kids became adults. And we got two that have become a child, so that must be where they were babies before. No. Human. Um, I want to see what house it came from. Oh, there's Gris. Oh, there you go. See, so, yeah, they, they were babies before, and now um, a child, so he's growing up a little bit. Obviously lost a father. Always a sad thing. Right, okay. Where are we at now? Okay, Justice Dilemma. Knowing that he's not like everyone else, Crane is being beaten by the village bullies whilst talking madly in the village square. The duty of these tyrants is to protect the rights and dignity of every citizen, but the public is divided on what to do with this crazy villager. Most of the villagers, fed up with how he is talking and acting, want this man to be exiled, while others, well, oh, pardon me, want his bullies to be punished so they can no longer bully anyone. Um, Crane should be exiled. If we exile him, Crane family would not be happy with the decision. Some of the villagers are unhappy with this situation. Crane seeks compensation for the wounds inflicted by the tyrannical commune formed by the lack of security. Crane becomes disabled. Being disabled, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna be harsh. I'm gonna exile him. See what repercussions flow. There will be repercussions. I know that, but we'll just see what happens from there. All right. Coming in day nine. Have another boat here waiting for us. Oh, you do indeed. Okay. Okay, that's nice. Cool as. Right. Uh, overloaded with food again. Right. Not a bad problem. Newcomers. Hey! Newcomers will arrive in your village. Newcomers were seen coming towards the village where they came from they were, and they were attacked by looters. Several families, including children, were able to escape. Since they could not bring any of their belongings with them, they had to leave everything behind. At the end of the day-long journey, they reached your village. They need a place to stay and food. They want to join your village. Well, I think we need the help, don't we? So I think we are... So fame is earned, might lead to new events. Uh, if we say we don't want them, we're going to lose fame. So they can join. All right. So we got five labourers now. Is that all? Is that all we got? Just two people. Really? One, two, three. Yeah. Four people. Five people. Don't understand. Um, five. Right, where's my houses? I've got the houses in. Hold the Z key round. There we go. And another one. Now, nice again. Ah! Oh, no. Um, as I said before, it'd be nice if um, the scroll wheel could rotate the house or something like that. But also, um, if you can hold shift down. Well, that's going to help. Put another house down. It's going to put it, down it does. Oh, there you go. I'll take it back. If you hold shift down, it keeps the build. All right. Now, what we need to do as well is I need to put a path in. Yeah. Yeah. 
there. And it will pass there. There. Right. Coolies. Right, what's this? Spring is coming. 26 days and 3 hours. Well, you know, shit, we're in summer. Um. Yeah, okay. Alright, cool. Uh, what have we got in the way of silver? 32, so probably not enough to do our field yet. Field. Cross. Over there. This fifty one silver. Right, so it's not cheap. Right. Rain was expelled from the village. Right. Cool. So we're gonna be busy building these these houses. Um you know what, I'm gonna prioritize them. I really want to get these people housed. You know, I'm going to build a couple more houses just for the sake of putting it in. Now, while it does keep them, it doesn't keep the same rotation, which is that would be the other nice thing. Uh, keep the same rotation. See, it just resets the rotation. It'd be nice if we'd overwrite those small trees. You know what I mean? Anywho, for now, that will do. All right, five labourers, two builders, two builders. Three, no, make three builders, four labourers. Okay, cool. And we go from there. Okay, you are hungry. You're tired. Okay, but no, neither of them are hungry now, which is good. Cutting trees, yep, okay. Total families 12, total population 39. Okay. Water for the fields and the people. Got one water well there. I um, don't think yeah, they can't overlap. Makes it a bit more difficult, doesn't it? Because you want to um on there. Oh, I'm just gonna assume that oh. I'm gonna put fields down through there and I want to shame I can't overwrite like join that up. You're gonna have areas where you can't have water. I think that sucks. Down there anyway. Alright. I'm assuming just as long as part of it is covering in the water zone, we'll be okay. Alright, so things are still happening. Fishing boats heading out again. Uh, in here, build a ship. Alright, can't do that. Uh, right. So I'm not building any ships, they can go back and help with. Um, with labouring, so in fact we can put them on building, another one on building, that's the thing we can do, so like if we're not doing something particularly, then we can always send the um, the members of the community out to uh, other jobs. Have we progressed up here any further? Uh, no, not really. Like those stones here and those stones there, they may going to there. Okay. Right, so I'll build these two houses. Uh, what else we got here? A birth, now a child is now a child. Good. No stone stored. Why have we got no stone stored there? We've got timber stored there. Where's all my stone gone then? Hmm. 105 stone, where is it all?
I'm gonna do that back to 100. I don't need that much done. Okay. Objective started. Time to go fishing. Right, what's the objective? Build a shipyard. Find the boat to the fishing hut. Sign a ship builder. Oh, okay. I'll just. What do I sign? Oh, we've assigned five ship builders. Don't really need that much. Okay. Get you ended. Right. So, what did we get for that? I can't remember. We got some stuff. The village is growing. So we got some coin. Oh, look at that. We got four tree of life. Four on the tree of life. Excellent. That is fantastic. That is what we need. We need one more. One more, and we look at getting some clothing, and that should help make our um, our community happier. And then we can also start making some tools and swords and shields to protect ourselves or to go and attack people. Loot and plunder. Ah, the Vikings never did that, did they? Anyway, all right, that's where we're going to leave it for this episode, though. Um, we're we're building along. It's very slow, though. Um, but we are getting there. Um, yes, yeah, so this is Land of the Vikings. It's early access on Steam. Um, it's quite an interesting and fun little game. Uh, different take on average city builder. But uh, we certainly are enjoying it. I hope you're enjoying it too. And if you are, make sure you press that like button. Um, in fact, just press the like button anyway. Because it really helps out us on the channel. So uh, please feel free to go and do that. Um, don't forget that if you uh, aren't already subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing. If you do subscribe, make sure you press that alarm notification icon as well so you're made aware of when new videos of like Land of the Vikings or anything else are available on the channel. Of course, come and join us on Twitter, Discord and Facebook. Oh, hang on. Let's deal with this. Uh, some of the locals are offended by the new arrivals and complain to you. They say that the fish escaped because the newcomers washed all their belongings in the lake. Should we complain about not being able to catch the fish for this reason? The newcomers say there's nothing else they can do. Fishermen, they are constantly washing clothes in the sea. We can't fish. Not only are we losing the money because of them, we won't even have enough fish to eat if it goes on like this. Strange, we don't have a lot of stuff. That's why we have to use the sea to stay clean. Fishermen should be patient. Use the water from the well. Um, and forbid washing clothes in the sea. Uh, let's do that one. We're probably going to have food poisoning. All right, anyway, that's where we're going to leave it for this episode. I'm going to pause it now so nothing else pops up. Um... So yeah, don't forget, join us on Twitter, Discord, and Facebook. Details all down below in the description. But apart from anything else, take care of yourselves and your loved ones and your Viking tribe. And we'll see you again very, very soon back here with Duck Gaming and the Land of the Vikings. See you later. Bye.